We're entering into the giving time of the year. And Fabric Cafe wants to give back. Keep watching. Hi, it's Fran Morgan. And Donna Robertson with Fabric Cafe. And we have a fantastic show today. We have some great quilts that would be perfect for National Giving Month, which is December. And these would be fabulous donation quilts. And you'll want to stay till the very end because we're going to share with you how Fabric Cafe is going to be giving. I love that. So let's jump in and see our first quilt. So the first quilt that we feel like would be an excellent quilt to give as a gift or a donation is Checkmate. And I like this one because it has this really long strip here, so the cutting is minimal, as well as a really super quick four patch. So let's look at the fabric that we're suggesting. This is adorable. This is so cute. Now, everyone knows that we're cat people, so. That's obvious. <laughs> That's obvious. But I love this because I think it just, it would be fun for a little girl or a little boy. Mm -hmm. And it, this fabric will be going into this large strip here so that they can go in and look at all these cute little butterflies and cats and cool, cool cat. Cool cat. Cool cat. So I really, lo <laughs> I love that because I would, if I were little, I would do that. I'm big and I would do that. Yeah. <laughs> and then our number two fabric, and this kind of looks like cat toys to me, mm -hmm. uh, will go in the four patch and it'll be in the lighter place here. And then our number three is this great pink, which will go everywhere the pink is. And this has all kinds of fun words on it, which once again, I know how we are. We like to look at our quilts and read and look at all the little design details on the fabric. And so it's gonna make up a really, really cute quilt really fast. Absolutely, that is just adorable. It truly, truly is. So the kit information on that, it is called Kitty Crew and it is 8022519. And the pattern is Checkmate and it's from the book Quilts for Kids as well as an individual pattern. Now this one goes together very, very quickly. It has a big piece right in the middle and who doesn't love dinosaurs? This one is called Big Picture. It goes together very quickly with some strip piecing right up here. Let's put that one on the table. And this is so cute for a little boy. It is. But you know, I know some little girls that love dinosaurs as well. Oh, yeah. Well, that's true. <laughs> I shouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> but these are really, really fun um, quilts to do for children who might be in need, whether it might be emotionally mm -hmm. or physically. So right. it's a great way to give to an organization that helps to assist those children who don't have a lot to say for themselves. Right. And you know, at the end of the show, we have a very special surprise. So be sure to keep watching. And we've got a specific challenge for you as well. Oh, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be in the middle and you cut one big square. It is so cool how quickly you can put this one together. And so you make this big square, then you're going to border it and put the um, uh, strip pieced blocks in this section. So it has multiple borders. It has one, two, three, four borders. So it goes together very quickly. Yeah, the borders do go very fast. So that's the number one. The number two is going to be your background. So you can really see those little uh, blue polka dots. And then the blues, and aren't these just perfectly coordinated really to get are. those blues and grays picked up? So this one is called Prehistoric Time 8022293. Big picture is the uh, pattern, and Quilts for Kids is the book. Our next quilt is Simply Strips, and this one once again goes really fast. And I know you've heard us talk about it in other videos, how whenever you have a quilt with the same block that you're making over and over again, it goes so much faster because you kind of get in a rhythm and a routine on doing the block and it goes super fast. And this is one of those quilts. Let's check out the fabric. So Simply Strips definitely is one of my favorites. And we have some pieces and parts on this one. Awesome. So we can show you just how quick this is. So the Simply Quilt is from our uh, Three Yard Quilt Favorites book. And as you can see, we have our simple diagram here and of course all the cutting instructions. And don't forget, all of our books do have the enlargement instructions for each of the quilts as well. Now these are only available in our books, so mm -hmm. this is a great advantage to getting that. So in this case, we're gonna start with a strip assembly. And the strip assemblies are very, very simple. We're basically cutting three strips of fabric, selvage to selvage. We're sewing them together 
and then we're going to cut units off of this. So, or in this case, we're going to cut the actual block. Boy, oh, that's about as easy as you can get when making oh, a block. Oh my goodness, is that not simple? <laughs> yes, so as you can see here, we've just sliced off a block right on the end. So you're going to make several of these, you're going to cut your blocks, and then we're going to put them on the quilt, and let me show you that so fast. So here we have here, so we have our blocks here. And so in our case, the blue is the number three, the lighter blue is number two, and this wonderful um, kind of watercolory look is our, our focus. And you can see we just basically rotate the blocks. Now these do still have the seam allowance on them, so that's the reason why they look just a little bit bigger. But when you start pulling this together, you can see how amazing these blues look. And you know what I really like about this particular fabric kit is, oh, this one goes this way. I love how they're all blues, mm -hmm. but they're all different textures. So they really oh. do stand out from each other. Mm -hmm. So like the number two is that great texture and it really is it gives it the distinction that it needs. Yes, and you know, so. I love the movement in this, and you were using <gasps> one block, and it has so much movement in it yes. when you turn it. Yes, I totally agree. So this is just fabulous. Now let me just mention something else before we get into the kit one more time, and that blue is the color of the ribbon for prostate cancer. So oh. if you, as a quilter, know anyone that's going through that or would like to give to that organization, this would be a really great quilt to do for that. It is, a ni and it's a, nice, it's a nice lap quilt. It's a little bit longer, mm -hmm. and so if you've got someone a little bit taller, it's even better. Right, mm -hmm. so just perfect for that. So as we mentioned when we looked at our pieces and parts, this fabulous kind of a watercolor swirly fabric, here is our focus fabric, going in that number one position, the larger piece of that block. Our number two is this great kind of texture look that almost mm -hmm. looks like I don't know, like linen or I don't know what it looks like, but it's, I it's think it a looks well, like linen, yeah. Yeah, it's very cool, but it gives you a different texture, so it gives you that little bit of contrast. And then our number three, which of course looks great with the number two and equally <laughs> great oh, with yeah. the number one. Still great movement, a little bit different size print. This one's a little larger, this one's kind of medium, this one's kind of small. Mm -hmm. So they go together great. And this particular kit is called 8022520. It's called Dauntless. And the pattern is Simply Strips from our Quilt Favorites book. Now, another one that we have for you today is uh, the Courage pattern. And this, of course, is very obviously a salute to our uh, soldiers and our people who are involved with uh, protecting our country. And they show a lot of courage doing that. Now, let's put that up there on the table and we'll talk a little more about this. Now when you give to um, the families and the soldiers of the armed forces, it really is very, very special. It is and I'll, I will say that my husband at one point in our marriage very early on, um, he was activated and sent out of the country and it was a little scary but when Christmas rolled around, we got a very surprise package and it had all of these gifts for us for Christmas because he was gone. I'm gonna tell you, it is quite, <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to do this. It's quite touching to be the recipient of something like that. So giving these quilts really is meaningful and does really help the families, encourage them and support them. And I know a lot of times, whenever you're making it in the background and you don't see those emotions, you need to know it truly does touch people's yes. hearts. And it is a super way to give. So this fabric, the number one fabric, it's just great. It has these wonderful little kind of country looking stars and hearts, but it just has that homey feel. It's gonna be in the number one spot, which is right here. And this block is so super easy. Could you hand me the cropping oh, tool yes. and we'll show them how easy it is to make this block. You'll make several different um, strip assemblies and then you're going to do this very, very simple thing here. We are going to put the red in the center with a little white on each uh -huh. end the blues on the side with a little white on each on um, one end uh -huh. and then we do exactly the same thing with the secondary block and we're going to go right down here and we are going to well let's see i have to do this 
And so it's going to have oh, the blue yeah. in the center with the red on the side. That Same is block, great. just different color combination. Very cool? simple. So it's just strip pieced and very simple. Sure, extra simple. So it'll go fast. The simpler, the better. So here's your number one fabric. That's the red. The number two fabric is this wonderful cream color. And then the number three, carrying out that homey feel, are the uh, 4th of July looking that symbols is very of fun. watermelon, very et cetera. Fun. And this pattern is our Courage pattern, which is our current free pattern up on our website. Now, we switch those out ever so often, so if you want to make sure that you go online and get our free pattern, be sure and subscribe and ring the bell so that you get notifications. And we'll let you know when new free patterns come up. That's right. It's not too far away, so sign up today. Yeah, and don't miss this one. <laughs> okay, this one is 8022411 Summer Picnic. It's the Courage pattern. And this is great for the veterans and the military. Our next quilt is Rail Fence. And this one is, once again, I love how easy these are, which makes them really fun as giving quilts and donation quilts. Because once again, we have the same block made over and over, just in different colorways. And they're rotated to really give this fun movement and dy dynamic in this quilt. So let's check out the fabric. Oh, this is a so beautiful. I love these colors. I do too. These so are very nice. Kind. They are. And these are great because these are batiks. So we've got this great kind of a purpley blue batik here. Mm -hmm. And that will be our focus, which is, goes everywhere you see like the tree here, the center of this block and on each side on this block. So very nice. Our number two, beautiful contrast there, but still picking up those same colors will go everywhere the white is. And then our number three, oh wow, look how that pops. <laughs> that pops, that's gonna be gorgeous. Yes, and that's gonna go everywhere you see the darker color here and on the border. I love these colors. And also these colors are great representation of Alzheimer's, that is their ribbon color. So if you know someone that's going through Alzheimer's, this would be a great comforting quilt for them. It would, it absolutely would. So the name of this kit is Tranquil Garden. And the number is 8022521, and it is our rail fence pattern. This one is called Lickety Split. Lickety Split is super, we named it that because that's how fast you'll make it. It's done in strip piecing, and we're going to put that on the table and talk about how easy this one is. And we have more patriotic fabric. I love this one. I like that this, this is a little earthier colors. I think yeah. that's really nice. You know, those red, white, and blue really are the patriotic colors mm -hmm. for the U.S., but they're also great in these more earthy tones and really like a little it. more decorish. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, okay, let's do, um, let's talk about the quilt first here. We've got our blocks. This is made in uh, vertical rows instead of horizontal rows, okay. and you will strip piece. So this section of the quilt from here to here is strip pieced and then it's strip pieced again from there down. And we do write the instructions, so if you are using a directional fabric, it'll work in this quilt. You're oh. not gonna have things all whopper jawed going upside down and right side up. That's good to know. Yeah, it is, it's written yeah. specifically so it will accommodate that. So the first, the number one fabric are the fl flags, and they're going to go here in this section. And so everywhere you see this kind of taupey color will be the flags. And then the number two is going to go in this section so it'll alternate. Oh, that'll, that'll look nice. really nice. Yeah. And then the number three is going to be your sashing that goes in between and on the borders. Beautiful blue. And isn't that gorgeous? Yes. So this is kind of has that watercolory look with the um, variation of color and that is gorgeous. That is awesome. Now, one of the organizations that I know a lot of our quilters like to donate to is Quilts of Valor. Mm -hmm. And sometimes our quilts are not quite big enough and you need to add that extra border. So if you are gonna be donating to Quilts of Valor, one of the things that we have on our free goodies tab on our website is the add a border page. It's the instructions on how to add that extra border for Quilts of Valor. And as an additional bonus, don't forget that we also have fabric by the yard and some of the end of bolts that often coordinate with the quilt kits that we mm -hmm. have here. So that'd be a great extra thing. And you know, the really cool thing is, is with the Patriotics especially, as long as you get those colors of red, white, and blue in there, you could even add a fourth color very oh, of course. easily. Yes. Now this one is called Strength and Honor. The a pattern is Lickety Split. 
The number is 8022522 for the uh, quilt kit and it is great for the veterans and the military. Our next quilt is Brick Street. And once again, this is a very fun quilt and it's a little deceiving because it looks a little bit harder than it is. So we're gonna get our cropping tool on this one in just a minute. But we've got these great kind of turned blocks here so that you can really get a nice big area to see the fabulous fabric. So let's check it out. I want to talk about this just a little bit because one of the things with donation quilts is of course we want them to be very fun to make mm -hmm. and I know whenever I'm making donation quilts it always makes me think of who I'm giving it to and the organization or the person and I like thinking about that whenever I'm making it so you don't want to be thinking a whole lot about construction right <laughs> <laughs> so this is such a great block basically all we have here is a strip piece so we have our focus fabric and then our number two fabric on each side. Mm -hmm. And then we make the same thing again, but basically we're using the number three fabric and our number two fabric and the block is just turned. And whenever you do that, it creates this great pattern that looks a lot more complicated than it is. So very fast to put together, very fun. And this is such a great encouragement uh, fabric here because it has all of these you are cherished, you are loved words on it. And like I mentioned before, if you're like the rest of us, we like to look at our little fabrics and read them whenever we're using them to cuddle up and find that comfort. And so you say it with a quilt. Yes, <laughs> you do. So this will be everywhere you see the dragonflies here and on the border. And then our number two, it almost looks like garden stepping stones here. It does. We'll go in the background. So this can be your garden of love. <laughs> And then, <laughs> then our number three is this great green that also coordinates so very well, and that will be in the alternate block here. So this will be just a great, great quilt to add encouragement to someone's life. So the kit information is, the number is 8022523. The name of the kit is Thinking of You. It is the Brick Street Pattern from Fast and Fun. As we mentioned earlier today, December is National Giving Month, and there are so many wonderful organizations that you can donate quilts to. This year, Fabric Cafe has chosen Project Linus to donate to. Project Linus is a national organization that gives homemade quilts and blankets to children who are in need. Fabric Cafe is donating all of the quilts that you see here. And we're challenging you to donate to your local organization as well, just like we've challenged our Fabric Cafe team. All of us here have accepted that challenge and you can watch our progress on social media, Facebook and Instagram. From the Fabric Cafe team, thanks, thanks for, for joining, joining us. us.